Okay, you guys, good afternoon, late afternoon. I do apologize. I did say I was going to get this video out to you guys before 12 p.m. in the afternoon. It is now <laughs> creeping towards 4 p.m., if I'm not mistaken. Um, I literally just left Chinatown 30 minutes ago, and I said, you know what, I really got to get this video out because I'm very excited about this video. Okay, this is for everybody, but mostly for my fa fashionistas. I saw this beauty now you guys are looking you're saying okay it's a pencil skirt it's gorgeous let's see it's simple it's classic I want to move in a little closer it is amazingly clean when you go thrifting which that's what I was doing last night when I get bored what do I do I go thrifting I go buying I go to the stores late at night between the hours of midnight and 2 a.m. to see if the system has changed over and bounced out any um, new deals in clearance like if something for example is at Walmart and it's a holiday like like Valentine's just passed and at midnight the system kind of jumps over and then it jumps down to 75 50% 90% off so I go in the middle of the night to get the fresh pickings anywho I was bored last night I went to a thrift store that was kind of out of my comfort zone you guys and let me just get in on this skirt as you can see it's beautiful you're asking what kind of material this is when I first saw it um, I instantly touched it so what I did is I'm like okay this is something different what is this and I couldn't at first I thought it was maybe a soft wool blend but I said no it's it's, it's something else and I'm gonna turn it around and let you guys see exactly what it is actually I'm gonna tell you first it is camel hair now as I did my research later on that evening when I came home um, I found out that camel hair is um, luxury it's very high-end it's very sought after um, I had such a hard time looking up this particular piece I couldn't find it anywhere so what I did is I first said okay I was putting in the name and I'm gonna show you what name this is and you're gonna you're gonna flip out and when I tell you how much I got it for you're gonna flip out even more because the profit on this should be very um, it should be beautiful I don't know we'll see at first I didn't know how to price it but as I did my research into the middle of the night till like 11 12 o'clock in the morning um, I decided that um, I, I kind of figured out a price range that I want to go for so with that being said you're looking at this skirt and if you're not into fashion you're like it's simple but then I say I said camel hair you say okay so you start looking up camel hair and it's not rare but it's hard to find pieces that have um, camel hair and a lot of pieces that have camel hair are higher end clothing now that I said on Instagram did I say on Instagram no I said on my last YouTube video stay tuned this is vintage you guys just the um the cut of it I mean it, it I looked at it and I was like it's cute I felt it I, I knew it was something different and then I flipped it over so let me pause the video because I don't want you to see me turn over the mannequin so you can see exactly exactly who this is made by <laughs> one moment you guys okay that did take a minute <laughs> forgive me so look at this still intact beautiful condition tag still on there oh my god Yves Saint Laurent of course they dropped the first part so it's if you know it you might know it by Saint Laurent um, I just want to show you made in France Paris and look at this a hundred percent camel so I unzipped it and I actually turned the mannequin all the way around so I can get a very good angle. I'm going to pause the video one more time because I want to show you the perfect condition of this piece right here. Alright you guys, I'm back. Okay, as you can see, perfect condition. Nothing, I mean, it's like this person possibly wore this piece maybe, what, three times ever? Or it was just sitting in their closet. I'm going to show you guys the inseam and actually see there's a piece of lint there. I'm picking everything off this skirt because it's just so beautiful. The lining, gorgeous, perfect condition. I just want to peel this back and show you guys well, as I was looking. Let me see. Right here, the stitching is still in place. And it looks like it's like silk thread perfect condition let me turn it around a little bit here the zipper works perfectly let me zip it all the way up the zipper the only thing I would say possibly is that this part right here the zipper part is um, a little bit damaged just a little bit the buttons perfect as you can see as I get close in you can see the name you can tell it has not been altered 
the simple fact that this, let's see, is in nearly perfect condition. I was just simply amazed. And then to look and see that it was East Saint Laurent, um, super happy. I shouldn't tell you the price of this, you guys, because you'll probably fall over, especially if you're a fashionista, you know how big um, this name is, and especially to be vintage. So as I did a little bit of um, research, if I'm not mistaken, you guys can correct me in the comment section, I do not mind. Sorry about that, I did freeze the video real quick. Okay, so um, like I was saying, beautiful condition, vintage, 1970s, if I'm not mistaken. Like I said, you can uh, correct me in the comments down below if you're a fashionista and you know about fashion. And I'm just saying, I already knew who it was. <laughs> I already knew who it was when I saw the tag in the back. And then I, could, I figured it was vintage because of the material, the um, style of it. The, and it was a pencil skirt. And I was like, okay. So I, like I said, I did the research, did the research. And then I later found the um, line. And if I'm not mistaken, it came out in the 70s. So literally that's almost 50 years. And I just couldn't believe that this particular skirt, camel hair, 100% camel hair, was in this amazing condition. Just, I mean, if you just look at it, the, the seam, just everything on it is per perfect. When I was paying for it, the lady in front of me looked at it and said, oh, that's gorgeous. I turned around and showed her the label and she almost fell out. And she goes, that is like the find of the century. And I said, yes. And she goes, that's vintage. I said, I know, of course, right? So she was excited, I was excited. And as I did my research and found that it was very hard, I have, I was able to find a few pieces, maybe one or two pieces online that were for sale, that were camel hair. And they weren't pencil skirts. They weren't skirts at all. They were, um, let's see, what were they? They were like jackets and maybe bla a blazer by um, Saint Laurent. So I was super excited because I couldn't find the skirt anywhere. So I'm not saying it's one of a kind, but so far when I do list this online, it will be the only one out there like it. All right, you guys, I'm gonna stop this video because I've been rambling for seven minutes about a vintage beautiful skirt <laughs> made of camel hair <laughs> by uh, Saint Laurent um, from the 1970s vintage, just saying. Um, definitely find of the day, deal of the day, but obviously you guys can't run this deal because it's, I do believe it's a one of a kind. Um, but I do guys, <laughs> I do wish you guys happy hunting on other deals. But yeah, this is stuff that I find when I go thrifting. I literally walk into stuff like this. Um, yeah. All right, everybody. I hope you have an amazing day. Sorry, it took me so long to give you guys this video. Stay tuned. Maybe I'll bring you a couponing video. <laughs> All right, you guys have an amazing day. St. Laurent. 1970 camel hair look it up online you guys see if you can you'll you'll be amazed on the price and make sure you put in vintage also have a great day